You know, sometimes I miss video opportunities that I later on really wish I had gotten, which makes me better at getting good video over time because I'm able to set things up and plan in my head. But uh, so we're up here in Salt Lake on this uh, address for the family member's vehicle that was parked at her apartment. And uh, I'm not just, I'm not even surprised as I pull down the street and I see a gold uh, Chevy Cobalt up there. So I break out my uh, binoculars and uh, not to my vehicle because it had no significance around the corner but right in front of her door it's you know and yeah i know people are gonna say oh i'm giving away our secrets and our tricks you know no one will freaking do anything about this they'll still do this stuff you know it doesn't matter so don't worry i'm not giving anything away people will still just do this stuff so we're gonna go pick up this vehicle and it'll be nice we can tell the finance company that we didn't make them wait until the end of the month to get their car. And that smirk she had on her face, too, was just priceless as she told me, you know, that she was hiding the vehicle intentionally and that she'd give it back on her terms after the registration expired and blah, 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 blah. And as she told me how she had swapped with a family member, you know, she had this little smirk on her face and I could see how her little devious plan was going through her head and how proud she was of, you know, who she had chosen and how far away it was from her house and how we would never find the car and you know that's what that smirk on her face was and she doesn't realize that in those two and a half seconds of us talking she gave me so much information and pretty much told me where the vehicle was at and to prove to her that I read her like an open book with big letters and pictures I'm about to hook her car she cracks me up <clears throat> It does make the job funner, though. It does make it, you know, the more challenging it is, the more into it I am. If I were to pull up to every address I had a repo on and the car was just sitting there, and I didn't have to do all this playing around and game bullshit, I might go do something more fun, like become a scout sniper or fighter jet pilot. It's about the only other things out there I can think of that would give me the rush this job does people so thank you for your creative talents but they just weren't good enough this time Too damn easy, huh? Hey! Hey, Lena! Get over here! Come on! Okay, you're done! Come on! Lena! Come on! Get in here! Hey! Right now! Come on! Get in there! This whole neighborhood on a Saturday morning. <laughs> there wasn't any amount of stealth we had. <sighs> uh, we'll strap the rest down once we're down the street a little ways.
around, or around the corner, I'll throw the other strap on and the lights and then uh, double check our e-brake isn't on. Keep it down, okay? Seriously. E-brake is on, it's a stick. That's why. Stay. Yeah, you blew that chance. Rowdy. whining about huh you're like I just want to come out and play daddy Someone did a number on this rim. Tires bulging bad right there. And they actually bent the metal rim, or I guess it's aluminum. Aluminum is a metal still, right? So yeah, that's two of these in one day. Vehicle swapped with a family member and I went to the family member's address and there's the vehicle. Makes no point. Put all that work to hide your vehicle. They must really think we're stupid. Just don't have access to the technology, but. Here we go. Another day, another dollar.